Let's see how we can install Luke's FSR3 mod into Shadow of the Tomb Raider without UI glitching and ghosting. As always, like and subscribe to the channel. Before we do anything, you must disable the Epic Games overlay if you have the Epic Games version of Tomb Raider. And don't use MSI Afterburner, otherwise the mod will not work. After you've done that, go to the link in the description and download the file. When you open it, you will see three files. These two files are for non-RTX users. Use one of them to enable DLSS. Don't use both. This one will give you some errors, but you can get past them without an issue. This one is working as intended. Open your file location and open the game once. As you can see, I can't use DLSS. Then extract one of these two into the game application folder. Run this registry file. When you open the game again, you can see my DLSS option is available now. After that, extract the upscale files to the application folder. Then rename this file like this. For AMD users, set this command to true and save it. NVIDIA users don't have to do that. Then open the game. So we got FPS along with UI glitching and ghosting. To fix that, go to settings and disable DLSS and VSync and then set the anti-aliasing to SMAA. You can see I lost some FPS, but the issue is gone. That's it. If you learned anything from this video, like and subscribe and join the Discord if you have any issues. Link down in the description. Have a nice day. There's a road. Let's check it out. This whole area sealed off. Yes, sir. If there's anything here, we're gonna find it. When's the last time this thing was serviced? This is rusty. Don't get distracted, Mendez. What are we looking for here? Anything that moves. Anything that doesn't. They still didn't find that relic. I'd love to be the guy that does. <laughs>